Hi there everyone, uh, this is Liz, uh, we are here to discover Art Knight. What is that game? Mm, it's an anime, anime heart uh, puzzle solving as I say. <laughs> because you have some uh, character uh, units, operator as they call it, and we'll try to use them to prevent the enemy. They start uh, to spawn in the red square, there might be multiple red square though in the map. And they're trying to reach the the blue the blue square, and there might also be multiple blue area as well. So you use your unit uh, or operator uh, to prevent them from reaching the destination there. So there's three components in that. You either uh, you place your unit on the uh, properly. You skill their timing. Uh, you you skill. Uh, you use their skill on the right timing to get the, the max value from it. And uh, you also select select the, the team you will be using as well. So here in the demo we have a uh, five character, but uh, each, uh, each mission has its, has its own uh, composition. So. Um, First thing first, it's a free game. Uh, the game was designed to be uh, clear with only three star or three, two star operator only. So if you guys want to to do a challenge, uh, a YouTube challenge with that, that would be a good challenge, right? <laughs> Just clear the game with only two star and uh, three star operator, which is are the the two lowest uh, uh, rarity in this. Uh, uh, in this game, there's no one star. So even though there's higher rarities, it it goes up to six star. Uh, the higher the higher rarity character does not mean it's better. Uh, it's because the role they have each un each character each operator in this have their own unique role they can fulfill, and sometimes you have mission that you be using certain operator. And other mission you'll be using other operator. Not necessarily, you know, you sometimes your six star operator it won't be it will be useless in some missions. Uh, it's more about uh, what's the role that I need in this mission. Uh, do note the though that with your uh, operator only above a four star uh, operator can be uh, upgraded to the elite two elite two skill, so they can upgrade their skill. Uh, to the next level, uh, there's two levels of skill. There's level one, uh, E1, and E2, Elite 2 and Elite 1. And only the four, four star or above uh, can upgrade to uh, e, E2. So, yeah. Just to make sure that you, you know that. And then after that, uh, uh, I'll recruit more operator. There's two way to get more operator in this. Uh, you hater recruit. Uh, you set the number of time you want here, and the max nine hour is the best, as you increase your odds to get higher rarity uh, character. So you just let the and the more the bigger you are in the game, the more the more you play, the more you'll be able to do that. The recruit. So we'll talk about how, how you can get some research as well to do your recruitment. Also, you have ad hunting. Uh, ad hunting is your banner, your operator banner. So this one is a gacha. So you gacha uh, your operator in there. As a new player, you get the the new player uh, ad hunting banner. Uh, and any of those characters are really good, but. Usually, it's uh, it's well known that Siege, Aegel, Stella, Exorcite, and Silver Hash are the the go-to to get in the new player banner. But any character you'll get in the uh, in the new player banner, a six star here, they'll be useful at one point. So no, it's no big deal if you don't get uh, one of those four. 
in the gacha. So some people uh, want to reroll their new player banner because of that, but uh, it's not worth it. Not necessary. As we said, we don't need... <laughs> it was designed to be defeated with 3-star and 2-star uh, operators, so... Not a big deal if you don't have a, a those six star uh, operator. And after that, of course, you need resources. Uh, and you see here at the top here, uh, you have LMD, which is your basic, most basic currency, like your your money there. It's used to upgrade your units and build your base for crafting. And then you have your uh, your cert certificate. Uh, using the the head-on thing, and then you uh, it's it's a yellow or yellow or green. After that, you have the shop voucher. It's red, and you can use that in the the shop. You get it from uh, daily quest and from uh, AP mission. After that, you have the orundum, the red one there at the top. It's used for rolling in your gacha. You can get there for free in the daily and weekly quests. Uh, also, you can do annihilation quests. Annihilation quests one, two, three. If you complete the one of the one uh, both uh, weekly uh, those quests, you'll get uh, two point five, two point nine k uh, from all those annihilation quests one, two, three total. And originite. Uh, Originite is the yellow one, the premium currency that you can pay for real money if you get it. It's used mostly for scale, but you can transfer it in any, anything else uh, we just this, uh, talk about. So. And you can, get, you can get some for free as well. Uh, there's uh, the first time you clear uh, a map with 3 star, you get some uh, Originite. Uh, you also get Originite when they do maintenance for the game. Uh, when there's a maintenance, they sometimes give you as well Originite. Uh, they also hold official event. If you participate in those, you can get some Originite as well. Of course, and then you, that's, and that's pretty much it. Other than, <laughs> other than spending the game, the good value for them or your Originite is usually used in the shop. And and you have a mile milestone level pack that you can you can buy over there, and uh, they say it's up after level fifty. Uh, it gets diminishing return though. So as long as you are uh, buying those before level fifty, you have good value for your originite there by buying them uh, by using them in the shop. Uh, Milestone level packs, yeah. And then afterward, it's uh, mostly saving them for skin, the skin that you want for your character. Then after that, you have some uh, mission to do, your grinding or farming mission. That's where you go for alienation stage. Uh, we just talked about uh, for the Arun Doom uh, currency or the Gacha. So you can do your animation stage, weekly, cap mission uh, for farming. Then you have your supply mission. Supply mission, you, that's where you can get some LMD, XP, uh, skill book, material and furniture for your base. And red shop voucher as well. And finally, uh, after that you have the base, which is the big, big mistake usually the uh, new player make. Is the base here? The two five two, uh, base uh, guide here. So it's basically you want uh, two trading poles, two power plants. That's the two, and the five are your factory. So that's what they mean to two two five two set up there. It's five factory, two training poles, and two power plants. That's the most efficient way to do it. And like I said, you have the link in the description for that. That's also the, the most common mistake in that game. Uh, 
but then here you'll have uh, also when you have a base you have to have thing uh, one unit to operate it uh, and they will get tired from uh, doing it so you have to uh, send them in the dormitory uh, you can also upgrade your dormitory uh, over time so that uh, your operators uh, recover faster in your dormitory as well and also you have uh, your friend list friend list can be useful in this game uh, you have the support unit that you can deploy as the for your composition team the, com the composition of your team uh, at the beginning of a mission and also you can uh, uh, unlock some clues that give you a little bit of reward as well when your friend you can uh, use that uh, with them as well and that's pretty much it for the this game it's an interesting game uh, it has good art it was not it was not my taste um, I stopped I started I stopped playing uh, playing it but it is uh, it is a decent game though if you're interested uh, in doing those puzzles and uh, yeah it's more like a thing you can put on your on your mobile because it's a mobile game it's more it's more of a game you can put on your mobile and, and the missions kind of uh, work by themselves really so and uh, they're good good looking character uh, uh, character here or, or operator in this game as well I love the heart in that game so that's uh, Art night for you. Uh, also, if you have more questions about the game, <laughs> make sure to join the official Discord. That's where you can ask a, a question for for people as well uh, playing the game. That's where I ask some of those questions because I didn't know as well. Until next time, until we discover another game, <laughs> it's Liz signing out. Uh, later.